Hello everybody, Chaotic Fear back again with Iniquity Survivors. This is, a, again, like the other video, an early look into the early access version coming later this year. And the last video, I'll put it down in the description below if you want to see it. We are playing as Alder Husk, I think that's how you say the name, on the on the first map um, with the Rune Agreed, which didn't seem to work on the second stage, but we are going to make sure when we're at the hub we make sure everything is working as intended again you can switch your stuff around if you want totally different build if you need to uh we're not gonna put anything on we had to put this torment on i don't want i'll show off this stuff later in another video but i'm gonna have nothing on uh just keep it out of the way we're gonna play the raging sands strong winds gusts in the desert and you came prepared but what you didn't think is what sh uh shines shines i think that's the word above the dust so we are going to play this map this one i struggle on as you know we already struggled on the game because we couldn't beat the boss we do want to try different skills so if we can get rid of these um death grip draws in shadows gripping all the enemies caught towards the player and taunting them good for a tank build i don't want to be a tank meteor summon a fiery meteor shout dealing 50 percent spell power equal four elemental damage Every 0.5 seconds for five seconds to all enemies. Yeah, you know what? We're going with that. So we're gonna bring that in, and then what's this? Inspiring battle cry. We don't want that. Well, no, that'd be good. That's a good team base one. We're not gonna do that because we're not in the team. I still think this is really good, but this one, when it has that ability, is insane. Um, it stares all enemy nearby enemies within four yards. Yeah, this is a good team-based one as well. Gather energy over 2.3 seconds at the player's location. 300% spell power, elemental damage to all enemies within 7 yards. Enemies in the center. Hey, ooh. So we got AoE, AoE. Yeah, we're going all AoE again, it looks like. Um, flames erupt from the ground beneath within three yards dealing 20 percent attack equal to elemental damage to all enemies within you know what we're just gonna do this i just want to we're trying everything that's a little different that's all we'd be doing so we have meteor rain aoe we have shatter devastation aoe and suspending flames aoe what we're gonna do differently is we're going to turn on auto attack which just isn't probably the best one for auto attack honestly but where is it controls can i set it here i don't think so i think i have to right now yeah yeah i think i can do it in the main part like main menu but that's fine let's before we start playing we were using the rune agreed which again i did explain it worked the stage two i don't think it worked and then at the boss it was pairing but we had that glitch with the boss we don't we're not going to use this right now we want to show off another one if anything's going to help me with spell damage that's attack dealing spell damage has three percent chance to create a voltaic area which would be really good it's reduced by eight that you know but that seems like it'd be really good um i think that's what we're going to try all skill cooldowns are decreased by 0.5 seconds. It can critically strike. I, I want to try this one, the Twilight. It seems like there's a huge disadvantage, but a huge advantage too. So we're going to do that. We're going to go with that. And I think we have everything we want to do. We have the player list. If we have other players, it will show right here. Okay, let's do it. Oh wait, we got to switch our character. Don't mind me. Who do we want to use? This guy, he has the... He's the weak. I don't trust myself with that. This guy does physical damage, and he has that third attack that's just massive, and then, yeah, if you're inside here... Auto attack. It's just auto attacks, though. But we were we we're going to play as this man. Ishar. Ishar? Isnar? Ishnar? I don't know how to say these names. I'm terrible at him. But we're going to go with him. Make sure our rune is on. Let's do it. You can see this guy. Lizard looking dude. Just serpent like. We Again, we are playing single player. We are not playing with anyone online. None of that stuff right now. 
I wish you could speed up to starting game time if you playing solo. <laughs> Let's do it. The desert is very interesting. Just in that location, okay. There's our first one. There's the light. Ooh, and there's a, okay, cool. Auto attacks deal through initial damage equal. So that, <clears throat> that would build our auto attacks. Infuse your weapon with elemental energy, causing your auto attacks to deal elemental damage instead of physical. I feel like that'd be good. And that slot that gives us our armor, but do we want armor? We got nothing good here. At 15 pride. Aligned Cantos Collective Standing Still grants you ghosted damage taken reduced by 30% while ghosted. Increased spell power though. Do I want to rely on spells? But I got nothing here. I kind of got to take something. We'll move our elemental damage first of that. This is the circle we want to be in. And there's that rune activating, I believe. Where they take massive damage. Okay, we got more slot spell damage. Yeah, the spell damage increased. We could go that route. Elemental damage dealt by 20%. But spell damage, which is also elemental. Hmm. I'm going with it, because this is all spell damage. Besides this one here, we gotta switch that. Let's go. Okay. Uh, deal damage with auto attacks, yes. And it does do the attack plus spell. Yeah, and, and we do elemental right now. That would be spell power. That gives us sloth, that gives us our armor. We'll see. I'm not sure if I'm building properly, obviously. I only do one damage. Oh my god. We gotta really be inside this circle. We do no damage. This is gonna be a worse run, guys. Um, what knee would be good to have? I don't know. I don't build properly, but having, you know, these things, this thing, like takes away half my thing here. Well, they take so much damage when they're in that circle there. <laughs> yeah, half my circle's gone. I don't think it fully works. Get rid of you. You're wasting my time. But yeah, this area here kind of does something to your... AOE skills there. It's not going to help too much. Do you know, 1% elemental to all enemies within? Yeah. You know what? I want, kind of want to build elemental. But that's pride and it would be spell power. Oh no, elemental, right? I want elemental. Does anything do elemental? Nah. But spell power would be good to have. That's pride though. I don't want pride. Lust or sloth? Increase armor by 16. Or I go down here. I think our skills will work down here. Really gotta increase that auto attack. Ain't gonna be able to do anything. Really gotta rely on her uh, spell powers and stuff. Did I reduce it? Is that what I did? Yeah. That's fine. I don't have any. We're not taking this. We already did that before. That's envy. Our build is gonna be so bad here. But it does that, I mean. Raining down.
Like that stuff's really good. Being able to stick with it is just getting to that point. Brass envy. Hmm. Yeah, my build's gonna be all over the place again if I don't start building properly. But I already got four, you know, four different things going. But this would be the spell power and elemental damage, which is kind of what I'm wanting too. And that does good damage. Got meteor rain, shattered, and suspended flames. Okie dokie. Envy, Wrath. Envy can be used, but I don't have anything for it right now. But max HP gives a little bit more damage on our auto attacks. Yeah, we got frozen and that stuff, but we do need more damage. Hopefully, we should have no problem making it to um, the next stage, and I can explain what it does. But this build will be really bad. <clears throat> nice feature is they show you the golem's attack and what they're going to do, like where it's going. Handy. Um, wrath, yeah. Create a three, yeah, and it does the spell power. I'm, I don't have spell power. That would be this. But like focus on the energy, elemental, not energy. You always want to focus in circles. <clears throat> You'll always do all your damage here. <laughs> I don't want to do that. Yeah, I can't hit him this way though, so I gotta come up close. Um, lost gluttony. One of these days, I will get good at the game and I'll know what to build. Inside the circle, you always want to focus it. My damage is already weak. I should have went auto attack because that's what helps. It builds my auto attack and that's what I should have been doing. My focus should not have been spell power. I think that was my mistake, but... You live and learn. I'll have to play this character again, I think. Yeah, let's do it. That way it does elemental damage. I kind of have that. I like how that stops them from moving and it does really good damage. Yeah, up here. Blocks your stuff. That's not good. But we want to stay away from that area. <laughs> it just blocks everything. Um, day. Yeah. This would be good. It's spell damage, elemental damage. So, I mean, it gives me pride. I don't want pride, but I mean, we kind of need something to do. Die soon. Oh, we're doing three damage now, you know, when you're outside of the circle. Now, critically strike, that would be good to have. I think we knew we got to put this back up, right? Like, we do have it's going to cancel out, and that's a waste of a uh, thing. 
but I, I kind of need the damage. that damage auto attack is the thing you want to go with this character for sure I kind of did mess up um, that's my bad obviously don't do that I need help yeah, it just resets. That, that was a good chance, and it did reset. Like, first time using it, it's huge. I can get it in a circle. Oh, I didn't get close to him. Hold on. That should end him. There we go. Well, you know, we didn't do very good with any of this stuff, but uh, we're making it to the next stage and I can show you the map. We will use this character better next time with auto attack build. Ah, yeah. That's my mistake. Where are you running, dude? What? What is happening? What is happening here? They were all lined up in an army. That was interesting. <laughs> That's so interesting. <laughs> Let's go to the shop. Um, the storm, yeah, so this is gonna be the unique part of the game. The second stage of the desert absolutely wrecks you. The sandstorm doesn't really do much visibility, blah, 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 you know, that kind of thing. It'll impair that, but besides that, you're pretty good. What are, I don't even, we're not building anything proper here. We're just going to look at whatever, I think. We're going to take out greed, though. Not even here. We'll take out lust. And that's really all, I guess. Uh, we'll go by rarity though, but yeah, and then when the sun comes out you have to hide in the shade I will try to show that best I can or you take damage and you're gonna die And that's just what's gonna happen and you don't want that. At least I don't think you want that um, Anything good here We're just gonna buy that because why not things change anything good no Get rid of that and then we're gonna go here. So what do we have? We have four gluttony. If we get two more, I guess it would be good, but I don't trust it. Let's do that. Um uh, trying to remember what skills I use, you know. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, that's uh, pride, right? Yeah. You know what? We're building random. We're. It's not going to work. It's not going to be a good build, but uh, that stuff looks really good. So if I do one. Yeah, just look at that. Oh my god. And if I do two. It looks the same, but that's going to be critical site. This will all do normal damage. And then this is just the same. That's fine. What happened there? Did I summon that? No. Anyways. Let's go start. We're going to try our best to be able to hide the fact that we are really bad. And we'll hide in the shade as we can. You will see the difference between the sun and the shadows. Yeah, this, this will have to be fixed. It blocks everything. You don't do your full damage here kind of thing, right? Let's do it. Yes, let's go. I love that. Oh, yeah.
Honestly, it's not bad. We're not doing bad against the enemies. Enemy force have been defeated. Uh, increased attack power by 15%. You know what? Wrath? Uh, blah, blah, blah. You know what? Reroll. I don't know what I want, honestly. It's not really good elemental damage. Why not? Now you gotta find shade. Right here. See? Well, we're getting destroyed there, so we gotta run. You can see how much it hurts, too. It was doing damage when I was outside of it. I don't know how long this thing lasts for, generally. I don't know if it's like the whole level or not like that, but that's fine. Yeah, see, this would be really good. And it gives me the lust. I mean, I'm building terribly. Get out of here. And the map has changed again, which is great because now I don't have to hide. But you can see the sun. It will do damage, and I've, I've been taking a little bit of damage. The upgrades to these uh, spells are really neat. I don't know why I used that. I did not need to do that, but we did it anyway. That's okay. Uh, sloth. Yeah, sloth would be good. Oh, increase all spell cooldowns. Oh, increase. Wait. Gives me armor. We'll see. I think it just makes my spells worse. <laughs> I should be using spells, honestly. I should be a full on auto attack. That's what I should be. Get in the sandal there. Yeah, that, that move is great. Is he going to start doing damage? I want to show that off real quick before I die. I'm in the sun, it's not, oh yeah, it's heating up right here, this bar. Then you go over here, it starts decreasing. So there you get the full effect of what it actually is doing, how to notice it when it's getting too close. There you go. Even we learn something every day. Void strikes now deal physical damage. Void strikes can yeah. Envy. Mm. Gonna re-roll again. Suspending flames. I don't use suspending flames, right? Rat. Oh my god, I got. I just banish this and hope for something better. Pack power, envy. Eh. Why not? Ain't gonna hurt, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. My build, man. I really need to work on them. I gotta run. You can see it's building up again. Can I find shade beforehand? And we're back to normal. We're okay now. Like, my build's not overly bad when it comes to the enemies. It's the bosses, man. My build's so bad. Like, this is all mixed, right? Like, it's not doing anything. Gluttony? Why not? Give it a spell power increasement. And the sun's back out. We're gonna die soon anyway. That is handy though. Huge. 
Um, you know, we don't have any projectiles. We should do that next time. Show you the projectile thing with that. I don't know if it stacks. If it's stacked, I think it would be insane. I would like to try that, honestly. Uh, that would heal me. I mean, I can't really do anything else. Gotta get moving here. All my spells. The spells do great damage, especially inside the stuff, but. Like, that's all so good. It's just it's not gonna be good against the boss, you know? I already know that. Oh gosh, what are you? I can't move. Oh my god, that was the first time I've seen that dude. He's a whirlwind me. He whirlwind me. But it did show up part of the map. I didn't get to see the second boss though, which is unfortunate. But uh, we didn't, uh, you know, we didn't do overly bad. I think my favorite skill from this one has to be the Shattered Devastation. Uh, but the Meteor Rain is really nice, especially with that upgrade. It did, a, it did really, really good, I think. We didn't do as good as the first map, but that is a bit of a harder map. Um, not overly bad. We can leave, go back into it. I'm not going to play a game right now, but I think the next time when you guys will look, we're going to we'll dive into, we'll try to do a proper build with vices. It's hard because RNG plays a big factor. Obviously get into the store, you can build, you know, 15 lust. 15 envy stuff like that um, by going even with the small things you don't need to buy the bigger ones I just like using the bigger ones I really got to learn a build to show off that looks really good um, and I'm going to try it's just gonna be hard I think I want to try projectiles next time all projectiles there's not many of, I the projectiles don't do a lot of damage that's my thing I know like this is really good this one is awesome um, but the other stuff I haven't really used reverse projectile So I think if we go for next time this will remind us I have not used this Dealing 20% current HP I wonder if that takes away my HP <laughs> I have to try that That yeah that one is too I don't care for that one too much But we'll do that We'll have it ready for the next time. I think when we, um, when it comes to this character, which we'll have to try again, going full auto would be the way to go. Because in here, it's like auto attack damage is reduced and movement speed is reduced. But if you're inside that circle, the flowing rapid, your move speed is increased by 120, your damage deal taken is reduced, and your auto attack damage is 60 percent more so like this would be huge you get an I guess from your normal damage it'd be an extra 30 percent but but since you start your auto attacks are all magically 30 percent less this would be really good because you get that this 30 percent increase from getting you know back it'd be 60 percent but nonetheless I think that we could really use that with auto attack with arctic bolts the poisonous blades and all that I think building auto attack would be huge um but yeah, we did mess up. We didn't do too good. And I know we got to try out this character. It's hard to make a build. There's so many options. And then, yeah, using your vices is so important. How do you get out of here? Just select. Yeah. The vices are so important. It's something I, I do struggle with. And that just shoots off in any direction. Why is my timer not resetting? I always thought it reset. Yeah, it shoots off in one direction. That's kind of cool, though. It is a projectile. That's not bad. But yeah, there we have it. That is the, again, early look into the early access version coming later this year. Um, you can play the demo. It is on Steam. Again, the video from the first one is in the description below. You guys can check out. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, please like, subscribe, comment down below and let me know what you think. And until next time, take care and have a good one.